Today, we're going to unbox this snotty, one of the popular off-grid inverter in the Philippines, and to check what's inside. So this one is a pure uh, sine wave inverter with AC charger. Okay. And it's 1 kilowatt, 220 volts AC and 12 volts DC. So this one comes in two models, 12 volts and 24 volts. So I bought this last year, uh, way back uh, last March, wasn't able to uh, use it. So we're just going to unbox this and check what's inside. So let's start. Let's see what's in store for us on this 12 volts, 1 kilowatt. Let's open this and hopefully we can check what are its components. Okay, so we have the manual. simple manual we have the this is a DB9 or 9 pin serial cable and the application that comes with it so see it's 2009 8 so uh, this is also this is also a new release. It has uh, LVD and HVD, which you can configure on what specific voltage you want. So it's now usable for any type of batteries, like if you have a lithium battery, uh, uh, LFP, or any type of that battery, flooded, sealed, this one is now cap capable unlike the previous version where it's fixed it doesn't have any user uh, parameters where you can change your uh, voltages okay let's set this aside and interesting uh, the unit is also a bit heavy You can see it haven't been untouched for a year. And we're going to check what's inside. Okay, so let's start with its input. So you have your RS232, your serial cable which is this one for extension so you need a RS232 uh, serial cable which you can buy from your computer store uh, right now you can uh, use a USB to RS232 so the uh, battery connection huge an AC output and your AC in and AC out and you have your own uh, charger protection circuit breaker that you can reset on the back uh, There is a huge lug Or a bolt on this thing. So I think this is where they put the uh, Core or the transformer and okay. You have your fan in here So I think this is going out so that it 
can dissipate its heat. Okay. So next, we're going to open this. So the only two buttons, boom, four. So you can feel that there's four. One, two, three, four. But it's not visible on the front. Uh, let's check why. Oh, on the side, if I forget, okay, the one kilowatt to 20 VAC, 12 volts model. Okay, so let's open this. Carefully. Okay. Oh, pretty neat. So you have your main toroid, right, which is tightly bolted, and your MOSFETs or the IGBTs. And let's see. Let's. And this so that we could check it closely. Okay, so you have your temperature probe, and let's check what's in the Hundred watt, twelve volts DC, and toroid. So your fan is going out to be able to dissipate the heat. It's. I think this one is the module that uh, handles the display. And so your serial is here. Your 12 volts connectivity in here it's black and it's black and red capacitors let's see if you can see the model of this hmm oh yes I think you can see it. They did not erase it. So it's pretty simple, as you can see. Uh, layout, layout wise, it's also good. They layout it properly. And the bolt is only one. Looking at this markings. And let's focus in here and check why is it there are four but at the first glance you don't see anything or just only two so we're going to mount this again So next week, I'm also going to uh, check the 24 volts version of this and we will compare well, what's, what's the difference. Okay, so indeed there are four buttons. And yes. There are four buttons in here. So switch one, switch two, three, and four. Interesting. Very nice. So that's it. So that's your, this is your 
12 volts 1 kilowatt model snaddy this is one of popular off-grid inverters that we have in the Philippines and I have 24 volts we'll check and compare well, what are the components are added so I'll take pictures and I'll also show it in the video and no more details so that when the 24 comes in we're going to check what's inside that's all if you like the video please like and good day